All right, guys, so we're going to see if this HDMI signaling override menu works on the C10 after the firmware update. So again, I'm just in the standard picture mode, type in 1113111 and bring up that menu. As you guys see, I've already gone through the liberty of putting in the BT2020 and all that good stuff. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go down to support software update. As you guys can see, I'm on 1311 or rather 0311. 30. I'm going to, I should not have it as allow automatic updates. Let me go back on to the main thing here and I just want to check for updates. And so, uh, no, I don't know. I guess I have no choice but to consent to that, whatever that is. Okay, so just check for your updates. All right, you guys see now 3.21.16, that's the latest firmware update. That's the one we're going to select and I'll come back after it's done. All right, so now it's finally done. All we have to do is restart the TV and see if we have our menu still. Now that, to, now that the TV's back on, you guys can see that we're at 3.21.16. So we're gonna go on over to our picture settings. We're going to get our remote, type in 1113111, and it is still there. We still have the HDMI signaling override menu. So even though I did hear claims that after doing the update, it has been taken away, for me personally, it's still there after the update. So if it's something that's a regional change, I would report that to, I don't know, LG in your area or something, or make a video kind of like duetting this and just say, hey, yeah, listen, I did the update and it's not working for me and just kind of show that off. But so far, it's working for me. So... I think for now, we can kind of call that a myth that has been busted. But I want to thank you guys so much for watching the number one brand in honesty. And until the next video, I'll see you guys later.